The latest consumer price index reading show no improvement on inflation last month. Prices were higher than expected in March. Now, the consumer price index rose four tenths of a percent from February. It was also up four tenths of a percent, excluding food and energy. Both numbers match previous month's readings. Now, for the year ending in March, consumer prices rose three and a half percent, and core inflation on an annual basis was up 3.8 percent. Both of those readings are stronger than expected. These are scary numbers. If I were part, if I were in the Fed, I would not be looking for a cut. Uh, so we'll see what they want to do. Well, Fed Chair Jerome Powell says that he needs to see inflation retreating substantially to the 2 percent goal before the Fed can start cutting interest rates. The inflation numbers have continued to run hotter than the Fed would like, kind of uh, giving them very little runway to cut rates. High inflation has also created severe financial pressures for most U.S. households, which are forced to pay more for everyday necessities like food and rent. They're living a real inflation story that's totally different. And low-income Americans are especially feeling the burden with already stretched paychecks due to the price increases. At the White House, Edward Lawrence, Fox Business.